And here we go. Welcome to the Dirtcast for Thursday, October 4th, 2012. I'm your host, the Dirt Farmer himself, Locke Michaels, coming to you from the Dirt Farmer Studios in beautiful downtown Farmville. Our top story tonight, the return to England Quest went live today with a few pleasant surprises. Uh, first off, let's look at the beast of a quest, much like the Return to Hawaii quest. As you can see on the screen here, uh, very few prizes that you'll want and horrendous uh, requirements. Uh, 500 of two different crops in just the first task. Uh, 800 in the second task. Uh, there's a tree, there's a couple of darts. Really this is just uh, a time waster. Uh, something for you to do uh, if you want to do it, if you want to challenge yourself. Uh, this is a heck of a challenge. I know some people did do the Return to Hawaii quest. Uh, they completed them. Uh, got very few rewards. But this one actually comes with a little bit of a twist. If you're a new player that has never been able to get the English farm, the ECS as we call it, uh, you can now. By clicking on the quest icon it will travel you to the England farm and if you're a, a player who was never able to get the farm because you started playing after uh, it was released and it was discontinued now you can and not only that you can get the crafting pub the English pub which is the crafting silo and you'll have access to all the uh, crafts if you're the type of farmer that likes to get all the mastery signs this is a whole new set that you'll be able to work on and also if you're really new to the game and you don't have a horse stable you've got an un you've got a shell of a horse stable it will still have to be you'll still have to ask for parts you will still have to build it but you'll be able to force breed or stable stuff as we call it and we have uh, directions uh, on our YouTube channel which you're watching right now that will show you exactly how uh, to stable stuff and as I said with the stable these items the harness the horseshoe are no longer available obviously the brick and the nail on the board they are still available in the game but the harness and the horseshoe are no longer available but you will be able to ask for them uh, via the horse stable that you'll have on your farm when you go to claim it now those of, of us who already have the English farm this isn't anything exciting but for new players uh, this is something um, they may have thought they they would never be able to get, and now they can. And this may be one of the reasons, definitely a good side effect of uh, the Beast Quest, which is Return to England. One thing that you will not be able to do, the English license, uh, this re-release does not include the storage license. If you wish to have it, it can be purchased in the market for 75 farm cash. The storage license to the English uh, countryside is unique from others in that it also unlocks the home and English countryside crops for planting on all farms, uh, which is why some of us uh, have access to those crops on most farms and some don't. You may be able to go to chat uh, and persuade them to give you the English uh, uh, shipping license but if not it is 75 farm cash and once you get your England farm as you can see here on the screen you'll be able to expand it all the way up to 38 by 38 for coins and now it's a total of approximately 18 million coins uh, which most of us have more than that as pocket change these days for newer farmers it may be a bit of a challenge but what in this game is not a challenge uh, and I'd like to say a special thanks to uh, Heather and Dennis for putting this guide together for us and, and showing us exactly what to expect with the um, with the addition of the new farm for those that don't have it. Our next story, uh, we actually uh, released this several weeks ago. In fact, it seems like several months ago as the social pig feature now it's being called the prize pig and it's uh, expected to roll out actually it's rolled out to some farms it's on a slow roll out at this at this time as you can see it's a little different it has aspects of uh, several other features but has twists of it its own and we are currently tasking to get you uh, a guide to the prize pig feature right now Heather and Dennis are also working on that one uh, like this you'll be able I don't know if you're feeding your pig or or whatnot 
but to get your pig fat and the fatter your pig is uh, the better the BLTs uh, <laughs> the better the rewards as you can see they will be introducing a ton of new animals to the game all pigs so it does resemble a little bit of the uh, Dino Lab it does resemble a little bit of the uh, uh, Unicorn Island and uh, the Dragon Lair but has aspects of other features it well as well hopefully we'll have that posted keep uh, keep watch on our blog which uh, is farmbuilddirt.com uh, through links on our uh, Facebook page or directly at www.farmbuilddirt.com our next story we all have arborists we all have farm hands and now we have farm workers it's a good idea uh, I'm I'm sure I thought of it myself a long time ago but Zynga just finally got around to actually making it you'll actually have a consumable like the farmhand like the arborist that can harvest all of your animal buildings your pens your I'm assuming chicken coops dairy barns stables all in one click the same way the farmhand will harvest all the animals that are out of the pens the same way the arborist will do the trees that are out of the orchards this one and from the look of it it does blooms too I wonder if it does orchards that's a good question but the farm workers um, we do have uh, questions we don't know what they will cost whether they will be farm cash or they will be easily obtainable through a building you have to build like the arborist center and the farmhand center that's slowly being released um, we have to wait and see hopefully uh, they will be free and they will be easily obtainable just like farmhands and arborists our next story my haunted house uh, a build your own just like uh, my farmhouse feature on the other farms this one is a haunted house you can actually build your own design your own haunted house for your haunted hollow farm we talked about this briefly uh, Monday night on FarmvilleRant.com or excuse me on the uh, Farmville Rant radio show FarmvilleRant.com and now we have more information the parts needed to build it and the as you can see on the screen here the different aspects of uh, of decorations you can use to build your own haunted house I really didn't get into the the, the dream house or the dream horse uh, hopefully uh, some of you will enjoy this feature but for me I probably pass on it or I'll do it later when I'm uh, already caught up on all my other farm chores and that's something that that we really need to remember because after posting this the most comments I got was wow slow down Farmville Zynga you're overloading us and actually they are slowing down uh, a bit these days and uh, you need to remember one thing this will be in the game forever it's not going to go away it's not a limited time you don't have to do it like the countdown because there's only two weeks you don't have to do it like the uh, a basket event that may only be around for two weeks this is around forever do what you have to do play the game your way uh, if you get bored one day maybe next week maybe next month maybe next year then you want to play with this and see what it's all about it's still gonna be there you don't have to stress out over it play your game your way that's the most important thing to remember and finally the dirt farmer has kicked off their second annual show your inner hero and anyone that can see my uh, profile right now can see that I am Superman um, we hope that you'll join us uh, the uh, event is posted on the farm uh, excuse me on the uh, dirt farmers uh, Facebook page you can uh, find a link there or you can search the uh, the event it is called the dirt farmers second annual show your inner hero event uh, basically it's a fun way to just change your profile picture for a few weeks but we're hoping it ex it inspires people to go out and be a hero to someone else uh, we do this uh, every year this is the second year we've done it uh, from the first of October until Halloween and we'd really like you to join us we have we just started just a few minutes ago it's only a few minutes after midnight and we've already got 14 people signed up and we've got a couple of Catwoman we got a couple of uh, oh we got Gambit from the X-Men here that's Jeff Farmer a good friend of mine uh, another Catwoman we've got a Wonder Woman uh, and 
Oh, there's a Batman. That's a Batman teddy bear, too. We hope you'll join us. And, uh, again, we will be back uh, hopefully tomorrow night with more Farmville news. If you have any questions, please uh, search Ask the Dirt Farmer on Facebook. It's a group you can just ask to join and post any question you'd like. And we will see you tomorrow. Thank you very much.